hot, did you know that a small scrap of paper like this can save your painting? It sure can. I'm Viv. I am the founder of Art with Viv, and today is my Tuesday's tip. So I'm going to tell you three ways that this little scrap of watercolor paper can save your painting. The first way, if you have a reference photo that you're working from, and you want to match the colors as closely as you can before you ever paint on your paper that you're planning on painting on. Take your scrap sheet of paper and work out the color scheme. Work out what color mixtures you need to get to match the colors on your reference photo. The second thing is, if you have palettes like I got, I mean, I have all different kind of palettes, but I like to use these inner because I have just like different colors on them, but they're too small to write the names of the colors. The little edge is too small to write them. So sometimes I don't know what colors I have in there. I forget because I have so many of them. So what I do is I take my scrap sheet of paper and I have, for example, I'm going to show you, I have these two yellows here. And I was, I needed transparent yellow, and I wasn't sure which one of these two was the transparent yellow. So I took my scrap sheet of paper, I painted them on there, and obviously this one's the transparent yellow. So then I knew which color to use. Number three is if you have your color scheme worked out, the palette of colors you're going to use in your painting. And you might want to add another color that you hadn't planned on it, but you want to see if it works with the other colors you already have. Just paint your colors onto your scrap sheet of paper and figure out which one, if it does, go in harmony with the colors you've already selected. Another, another thing you can do, and this is a bonus one, is if you have some blues and you want to pick the right blue that goes with your color palette over here, then you can test out your blues and find out which one. So it's really a good little painting saver. It saves your painting. You don't make mistakes by putting the wrong colors on. You can go ahead and match up your colors to your reference photo so you'll know the right mixtures beforehand. And if you have palettes that aren't labeled, you can figure out what color that you have in the, in the little container. All right, so that was my Tuesday's tip. Come back next week for another Tuesday's tip that will help save you time, save you money, and make you a better artist. And if you need a little distraction during these uncertain times, I have a free watercolor course on my um, website. It is a paint a beautiful butterfly in watercolor, and it's totally free. Just go to my website, www.artwithviv.com, and you'll find it there. All right, y'all have a good week. Thanks.